Professor Read More Books is logged into the portfolio platform and wants to create a sabbatical application. To do so, first, Professor Books goes to the documentation page and downloads the sabbatical application form, which he then completes. Next, we make a portfolio page by going to the hamburger button, create pages and collections. Copy a page, look for the sabbatical template, go over to the right and click copy page. Remove the word template, add your name at the beginning of the, the file name, the page name, and add the year when you will go on sabbatical. Delete the description in the next box, the page description box, and add your department so that the page is routed through the correct approvals. Scroll down if necessary and click save. The sabbatical page is much simpler than the portfolio page. It's basically two documents with optional supporting materials. You can add the documents directly from your computer by clicking the pencil icon. So now I'm going to upload the sabbatical application by clicking files, choosing a file from my computer, and making sure to select the PDF version of the sabbatical application, selecting upload and saving. And there it is. I'll now add my curriculum vitae also as a PDF file. And again, choosing it directly from the computer, upload and save. And I have a few supporting materials. So I'm going to again, choose files from the computer. I have a confirmation from the site and I have a book contract. I'd like the book contract to be first, followed by the site letter. I select them both and click upload. There they are. Scroll down and save. Now my application's all done. I can see what it looks like to a reviewer by clicking the display icon at the top right. Short and sweet. I need to submit it. I'll click the three dots on the top right and go to Manage Access. I'm going to submit the portfolio by sharing it. There's two steps. First, click on Advanced Options to allow copying. Make sure that's yes. Let's move Advanced Options out of the way. And now let's share with a person. When you click on Search, you have to go down and click in the search box. And I'm going to search for Personnel portfolios. You need to type the entire word personnel in order for it to appear. Select personnel portfolios and click save. At this point, I could go back to the dashboard by clicking the New York Tech icon. And I want to make sure that I submitted correctly. So I go to sharing settings for my ePortfolio pages. And I can see here's the sabbatical page. Under the access list, personnel portfolios has access and copying is allowed.